I'm actually a little heated right now because I just got done doing this commentary. The commentary is around like five and a half minutes long and our mic was muted. Completely forgot to unmute my mic, but ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the Reed Fees channel. We're on the road to 500 subscribers. Uh, yeah, so today's video, I have some Genesis gameplay in the background, Hyper Team Deathmatch recently added to iDubs. Thank God, because if it wasn't for this, I wouldn't be even making this video right now, let alone, I wouldn't be done the challenge just to unlock the Black Sky camo for the rigs. Yes, I finished it. I finally completed it. The grind is over. It took me about a month after Black Sky rigs were announced. And then we just started grinding, we just started grinding, we just started grinding, yeah. But the gameplay in the background is me murking people on Genesis, not with not only the E-Rad, but the Reaper payload. Speaking of Reaper payload, I'm, ma I'm making this video for one for uh, one reason and one reason only. Because if you're going for Black Sky Rigs, you better hop on. Because Hyper Team Deathmatch is in the game. Hyper Team Deathmatch, if you don't know what it is, uh, you get your payload I said five times. Seven times as faster as usual. So, approximately every 15 to 20 seconds, depending on your kill rate, and also depending on how fast your payload charge is up. Because, like, FTL, you can literally uh, die, spawn, sit there for about 10 seconds, and then you'll have it. With overclock, probably eight seconds. FTL is, like, the fastest, like, like FTL jump, it's probably like the fastest charging rig in the game. Or like ability in the game, not rig. Rig ability in the game, there we go. There we go, as you see, I'm about to get another four piece. And speaking of Reaper, if you guys are struggling with the skinny bot, don't hop on Ground War, at least for now. Uh, if you guys are struggling, Hyper Team that match is the best place for you to go. As you see, I just got six people with that Reaper. And on the previous, we got four, or maybe five, so. Yeah, so Reaper, you need four kills in one activation, and you need to do that ten times. Once you do that, uh, for me, I have solar camo. I don't know which, what, uh, what challenges you guys are stuck on, but this is specifically for Reaper payload or for Synaptic payload Reaper challenge. I was not, not even a lot of you people. I was struggling. I was struggling so much. Like, every time I would get to, like, three, I either die or I'd be so close to somebody and then it would run out. The frustration was real. The frustration was a little real in, like, my first couple of games in Hyper. I played, like, put, played, like three games of Hyper before I hopped into this match and then finally got two. Uh, I think, think we were going for number three right here. We could have got it, but, you know... It ran out, and plus, I think we only got, like, two people on that anyway. I'm not quite sure. It's a whole that advanced wave V right there, man. Oh, um, yo. Also, by the way, um, I got the solar camo. Once I unlocked it, I, I got, I got, like, 100,000 XP, and then I doubled it up. 200,000 XP. That's the most XP I've ever gotten in one game. So, it's not only worth it for the, uh, you know, camo on the rig, but it's also worth the XP. It's worth the XP, man. It's worth it. It is very, very worth it. But, uh, if any of you people are stuck on the challenges, such as the Reaper challenge, don't play Ground War. At least until next Friday. But I'm pretty sure you should be, you should be able to get it done by next Friday. Because that's when this mode is out of the game, and then they're probably, and then they're probably gonna add some garbage game mode that no one cares about. So, yeah, uh, I entered this with 1 out of 10. We finished it in Hyper. So, as soon as it came out, we finished it. Um, the maps I mainly got it on was Frontier and Genesis. And then I got one on Mayday. So, we got four on, like, Frontier, four on Genesis. And then we got one on Mayday. And that's how we finished it. Uh, I wouldn't recommend, like, big maps for this because, like, this is probably going to be running around like an idiot. Unless you push their spawn, which um, I mainly did. If you know spawns, you can just go in there and just, like, wreck them in, in their own spawn. Uh, yeah, man, that's pretty much it for the com. 
Um, I'm actually going to have highlights of me getting, um, me actually getting the challenge done. Just, you know, more demonstration on how to get it done. And, or uh, how I got it done. And then I'm going to fast forward to me unlocking the black sky camera. So, yeah, sit back, relax. I'm going to stop talking. Hope you guys enjoy your day. Till next time, peace. One over here, have to be. One, two, three. Come on, one more, one more, one more. One more. Come over there, over. Ah! Ah! Let's go! Where my sword? Where's that? Where's it at? Oh! Oh my God! I'm done. I got 101,000 XP. What? Coach. I got 101,000 XP just for that one game without double XP. That's 203,000 XP. That's the most. Oh my, that's like a million.